Welcome to the course. My name is Octoman and I'm your instructor for the next couple of hours in how to create Battleship 3D within the Unity engine. In this course you will learn multiple things. First off, button interaction. We are going to create multiple scenes, in this case a main menu scene as well as a game scene. And we are also coding an NPC player who is able to play against us, as well as a one player versus one player mode. We're gonna start with setting up the complete tile set over here by a 3D grid. We're gonna animate the water by using some code over there, as well as we're gonna create the little yeah, placing management or placing design onto the right side of the screen. We are actually taking turns and whenever we press a button, we are moving the camera downwards. So player one in this case is absolutely able to place his ships. For example, if we now would place or would like to place the carrier, we are unhiding or creating some kind of ghost objects, which are measuring if we are able to place the ship at this position, wherever our mouse is. As you can see, we do kind of snap based movement with the right mouse button. We are able to rotate the ship and we can still check it out over here. Also, we limit it to this particular playfield, so we are unable to place it in onto the other playfield. And once we are clicking with the left mouse button over here, we can place the carrier. We also reduce the number over here and all of that, of course, happens for the other ships as well. We're going to create them all one by one. We can place them next to each other, but we cannot actually place them over each other. So, so you understand that we are doing this over here as well. Also, we are able to clear the complete both settings by a button over there. So we write functions to clean the complete play field, as well as we give some auto place functionality, which is doing all the placing for us. We can hit this multiple times. We can also set the amount of ships later on in the game manager. And whenever we are happy with that, we can ready up and go into the playing phase. In the playing phase, the first player, if we are playing one versus CPU, the first player is going to see his boats, but the CPU will not show, of course, his own boats. He is using the auto place feature as well. So as you can see, we are able to shoot a small rocket over here to whatever the clicked place is going to be. We make the small animation, wait a sec or two, depending on the settings we are going to like. And now we are basically battling against the um, NPC player. And whenever whoever is winning the game, we are going to yeah uh, show a small, small win panel over here. Also, you can see we are unhiding the ships which are completely destroyed and if they are only partially hit, we are actually trying to set our or we are setting our computer to try to find the corresponding ship to make it fully destroyed. So that is something and even more which you are able to learn in this course. So if you're interested into how create a Battleship 3D course over here in Unity, feel free to take this course. If you have any questions, meanwhile, creating all this content, feel free to write me any message, of course. And yeah, let's get started with learning and creating our own yeah, Battleship 3D game in the Unity game engine.